What's good everyone, it's ZigZag here, welcome back to another GeoGuessr video. Today I'm going to be playing a challenge from Rainbolt's Discord server. It's essentially this game mode where you have a bunch of seeds and you have to get above a certain score threshold on every single one. So for example, on this first seed you have to score above 10,000 points, then you have to score 12.5, all the way up to a final seed where to win you have to score 25,000 points. So that's essentially what's going to be going on today. I'm very much excited to try this out. We're going to be against some of the best players in the world, which is going to be a lot of fun. And let's get straight into the 10,000 point seed um, and see how we do. By the way, guys, give the video a like if you're enjoying my channel. Yeah, that would really help me out in the algorithm as well. And here's our first round. We don't have to try too hard here. This should just be somewhere in Mexico, I imagine. Um, I'm actually just going to plonk Mexico because uh, on this 10,000 round, it should be it should be fine to just go quickly here. That was uh, actually in Jalisco there. And uh, someone actually, wow, clicking in the ocean and getting the right spot there. Interesting. Okay, next one's going to be South Africa. Again, yeah, it's, it's no point in really going too, too slowly here. Oh, that's going to be another nice score. Next one here, probably going to be Europe somewhere, maybe like Spain or Italy. Poll kind of feels Italian to me, so I wonder about like Sardinia or something like that here. Do we have any like, you know, that looks like quite a uh, Italian guardrail, I would say, in a way. Um, but I'm not really sure if this is going to be like max south inside Sicily or Sardinia. I'll try Sardinia for the for the fun. And it was just Sicily there, makes sense. Uh, next one here, going to be Ireland. And we've already passed the 10k, so we can just uh, get this one out of the way rather quickly here. The last uh, one here should just be somewhere in, uh, well, I thought it was going to be Bolivia. I'm actually right about that. I'm not so sure. I, th I think I've, I recognize places like this in Bolivia. It doesn't matter anyway, so let's just go here. Well, a day. Is it Sucre? No, it's actually... Okay, a little bit of a newbie moment there, but uh, sometimes I still struggle to recognize uh, 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 Chile on my on my worst days. But okay, let's head through to 12.5 thousand now. So obviously 10,000 will surpass. Let's see if we can do 12.5. Now we have to slow down a little bit more. This should be somewhere in Thailand. Looks like the front of the car here. So yeah, it should be somewhere in Thailand. I'm not really sure where when it comes to rounds like this. I tend to just kind of click up in the mountains like this and, and hope for the best. I was actually just a bit further north there, but that's a good start. As long as we don't miss the continent. That's all we need to do. Just don't miss the continent here and we should be fine. That was a pretty easy uh, Kenya there. This one, this, this crossing sign is the uh, Slovakian one, I believe. And yeah, we do have Slovakian bullets. So that would make sense here. Let's just go near Bratislava. And uh, yeah, well, it's just a bit further north there. Obviously, we've passed 12,000 already, so we can just go really quickly here. Just go based on our first vibes here. And the last round here, what's it going to be? Just going to be somewhere in Peru. Okay, so that was uh, a fairly easy seed here, I would say. Uh, we'll be correct about that region, guess. Yeah, nice. And uh, there we go, 23,000 points. So obviously surpassing it by by a relative margin there. Next one here is 15,000 points. So uh, let's see how we go. First one here should be somewhere in Colombia. Uh, so 15,000 points. Now it's actually failable with a really hard seed, but obviously that's kind of rare to get a seed that that's, that's that hard. So I still think just kind of guessing like but generally in the in the vicinity should be fine. Uh, that looks like a uh, Bogota one, doesn't it? Yeah, that's a Bogota kind of light attachment, like spells an H letter. Oh, this is more difficult, so it should be Canada. Um, it's like a rather, rather wide road, which is why I probably wouldn't go in Baltic, but yeah, it should be Canada here. Um, whereabouts is more difficult though, and it, and it could still be elsewhere, I suppose. Um, so, uh, where do I actually want to go here? Not so sure, I feel like Ontario is good, but then again, like if it's just like out here, it's obviously a lot more difficult. I think to hedge is better. So I think we'll just actually go like Sask here. Well, it's actually in uh, Manitoba. That's fine. 3.5K is obviously well enough to get us to the 15K. Uh, this kind of feels like Washington to me or Oregon maybe. Uh, one of the two. So I, I don't really feel too concerned here. It's like massive West Coast vibes with this amount of lush vegetation. Like we see a bay here. It's actually to our east, which is interesting. So I guess there are certain parts of, of that kind of area of the world which could work like, you know, this kind of thing over here. Or maybe even thinking of like this kind of thing near Tacoma or something like that could, could work quite nicely here or near Vancouver. Um, uh, yeah. So um, yeah, do we see anything else here? I don't know. It's, it's one of the two. I'm sure we can actually like decide which one definitely if we, if we kept looking but uh, plate's kind of generic. I'll just go there and we'll find out. And uh, yeah, it was actually up there. So are we in the lead so far? Um, we're fourth at the moment, which is which is rather nice. Uh, although I can't even remember what was on the last round. So um, yeah, okay, next one here. Um, we need 15K. So this one should be Mexico. I've heard that when you see the whole back of the car, it's quite commonly seen in Sonora. 
even, uh, yeah, was it Sonora? I feel like, I feel like, yeah, like, this town had quite a bit of it, but I don't think we're there, because it's a bit too green, but I might try that, just because we're guaranteed to get above 15k here, so we should just be fine, right? We'll see if that theory is correct. Was just in Ciudad Juarez there, which is fine, and the last one here should be somewhere in, uh, in, uh, Finland, and we have, like, a, I think, Sami language here as well, so it's pretty findable here, but I'm just gonna go up here and, uh, hope for the best. And yeah, it was nearby there. Very nice indeed. Even found the town. Did Phineas? So there we go. 21,000. Obviously not a huge issue. This is 18,000 now. And uh, we are still cruising. So 18,000. It is possible. Based on these other seeds, like if I went Europe on the uh, on the Canada around there, it would be possible to lose. Anyway, this one is kind of feeling Canadian, isn't it? Uh, blue street sign there, like Alberta Bollard, I think, and like blue street signs are quite common in Alberta anyway, so I do feel good about that, as well as dirt roads, pretty common over there. Now, could it be any other kind of Bollard? I, I would like to say not, but, but I'm not that confident, to be honest. Um, what about this? Yeah, nothing, nothing too useful here. Uh, I guess, yeah, the question is, the question is, could that be a different type of Bollard? I, I don't think so. I think that is just, just kind of like a, an alternative Alberta one, but... We could run into trouble here with 18k if we're wrong, and we were wrong, it was actually just a Manitoba one there, so someone actually getting the right road. 2.9k though, guys, it's it's really going to be fine, I'm pretty sure, unless we run into something really difficult. Next one here, A12 and E77, uh, that kind of looks like maybe Lithuanian language with the E with a dot over it. Um, it does it does appear that we have Lithuanian ballads here as well, so yeah, should be fine with that. I don't even think we need to find the actual place here. Yeah, that's, that's a good, get, good enough guess, gets us 4.8k. Next one here, oh, this looks like a Serbian sign with the blue and white paint. We also don't have an antenna which fits for Serbia here, so yeah, just somewhere like southern Serbia-ish should be fine here. Actually, decently southern. We have quite a few mountains as well. It was just uh, in Pirot there, so it's, it's good for us. Uh, so 18k, still possible to fail, but this looks like Bulgaria to me. Just have to make sure it's not like uh, Turkey or something. Oh uh, yeah, we do have actually some Cyrillic language there, so yeah, I mean, Bulgarian, so yeah, it should be good to just send in the middle here and be fine. Yep, and have we already made it to 18k? I think we might be already there, no, almost. And this is Japan, so yeah, we, we're, we're home and host here, that's great to know. Uh, these are like Tohoku plates, I think, or, or maybe even, um... Now, what's, I can't remember what this region is called, but maybe even this region instead, because we have two horizontal ones like that. Um, so let's see if we see any other metas here. Um, hmm, not really too sure. I don't really know, like, that many metas for this kind of area, I feel. So, I think I'll just guess here. Obviously, we're, we're home and host anyway, so, yeah. Was well, just in Gunma there, or even uh, in Niigata. So, yeah, that's kind of like the bordering uh, prefecture between, like, uh, this region and Tohoku anyway, so that's fine. And we get 21,900, even with a bad Canada guess. So, it goes to show you that we still have some lenience. But now we head to 20k, so we have to actually play nicely here. We can't miss the continent, is the main thing. So... We will take extra consideration uh, so we don't get knocked out here. Okay, so this one, we have like a lot of rungs on this uh, like uh, insulator. So that should mean that we're somewhere in southern Thailand or Max North. Uh, but this feels more southern to me, like very lush. However, we don't see any palms. And palms are something you do see more northern, um, more southern rather than northern. So if we are south here, it is a little bit concerning that we see so few palms. Hmm. Um, you know, I, I do have some reservations about south, but it just seems so much more likely than north. I, I feel like I have to go for it, right? Um... Nah, maybe this is the throw, I don't know. I, I still think, like, look, we could click in the middle for hedge here, honestly. It's, it's the wrong guess, but it actually might, might be the right guess in terms of the context of getting 20k. I'm gonna do that. Screw it. And it was just south there. It's probably around where I would have gone. Um, but yeah, it could have always been Chiang Rai, which is the other state that uses um, those. So that's th fine, 3.5k. It's a little difficult here. So this is... Ooh, now I'm kind of regretting hedging on round one, I must say. Because this is Canada. Is it... Is it the Dempster Highway? I think that's the one that it might be here, which is the one that kind of goes south of Fort McPherson here. And it is relatively flat. I mean, by like kind of Yukon standards, it would be flat. So I feel like we kind of click around here. A road angle would also fit relatively nicely for like something around here as well. So I feel like that is good. It could be further up here, but yeah, again, I feel like it's kind of even flatter up there. Now, is anything else other, actually uh, possible here is the other question. It could be Alaska, which would be devastating. Um, I don't feel like I would, I've recognized it if it is Alaska, though. That's the that's the thing here. I, I do get the feeling that Canada is just more likely. Um, we also do have, like, a little antenna there, which I feel like 
you can probably see in both places. I'm actually not too sure. <clears throat> but uh, yeah, I feel like this is Dempster Highway. I want to say it is. Uh, and in which case, like, it can be anywhere like along here, I feel. And we should be like fine. But I could hedge for Alaska. I'm not going to. And yeah, it was just a bit further up there. That's good. 4.7k on a relatively difficult round. So now, at the end of this round, we'll actually see who's getting like kind of eliminated and who's, who's staying above. Because this was a difficult seed. Okay, this one should be in Switzerland. We have like a really... Uh, wide blur here um and yeah I'm feeling I'm feeling good here um now I don't really know what's the best region guess here but we are going pretty well for points so I don't think it's that important might kind of go southwest here just because the mountains are so vast but I think there's actually more coverage out here so I'm actually gonna switch to this side and yeah that was a good decision so it gets us a good amount of points there as well next one here is Brazil and we have quite a lot of like tree plantations. Yeah, this is a hard seed, no joke. Like I can definitely see people are uh, getting knocked out on this, especially if the next round is difficult as well. So yeah, definitely pay uh, worth paying attention here. Um, so, hmm. Okay, let's be objective. I am pretty good at Brazil, so I feel like I should be able to work this out. Um, so we do have, like a very like big haze on the camera here, and that's often seen in Amapa, but this, ah. Uh, I'd kind of be, like, a little bit concerned to go Amapa, I must say, just because it's such, like, red soil. I might end up hedging, uh, really a lot here, honestly, because, yeah. I don't know, like, is it Amapa feeling? Not really to me, but the blur is super concerning for that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, round pole here? Don't really feel like you'd see that in Amapa too much, so I feel like that's feel making me feel better to go elsewhere here. Yeah, a bunch of round poles, actually. Oh my gosh, guys, where is this? I'm a little concerned, I must say. <clears throat> um, I might just end up doing a big old hedge here, like in the center of the country, to be honest, like maybe like Goyas or something. Um, just because like, I feel like, <sighs> hmm, yeah, it's concerning this. I feel like a lot of good players are gonna get knocked out on this one, maybe myself included. I do really regret hedging on the Thailand now. I didn't expect this to be such a difficult seed. So, um, ah, like these little bushes here, I do feel like that's kind of better to almost send a bit further north here, like maybe even Tokan Chin's hedge here, just in case it is Amapa. Maybe I'm even thinking it could still be Amapa. Like I can't really see why it wouldn't be, but at the same time the soil is so red and I don't know, yeah, but like these little bushes on the side of the road do make me want to go further north. So I, I feel like I just send Tokan Chin's here, even though I'm pretty sure it's not there. I, I'm pretty confident that it's like not all the way down here, so. I feel like I just do it here, guys. I feel like I hedge like here. Oh my gosh, this is this is risky. I'm trying. Okay, it was Minas Gerais there. That gives us enough points to be in it here. Let's see what we get. Okay, so we need a good score here. It's Cambodia. We should be okay here. Oh, but that was scary. Okay, but we still can't drop too many points here. And uh, yeah, that was Minas. That makes sense. The camera glitch you also get there fairly often. I feel like if we just click middle of Cambodia, we're actually fine here, right? It is community world. So yeah, we should be okay to click here. I mean, it kind of looks fairly middle anyway. So I really don't mind that. I'm going to go for it here and see. And uh, it was Northwest there, but we get enough points to just barely get over the line here. So let's see how everyone did here. This is, we had to guess nicely on Canada there. So let's see what people got. Ooh. There's not many people get ab got above 20k here. Ooh, ooh, ooh. So yeah, let's see here. So, um, Lenly just making it in as well. Oh, and so, so many people, so many good players just missing out. Like Ning, Kratzu, Little Fox, definitely new uh, no, known people here. Um, yeah, like yeah, like I'm I'm recognizing a bunch of good names who missed out. And I mean like. Oh, that was interesting. Okay, so let's see here. We got like a bunch of the best players in the world. I'm just going to click all the uh, people who are verified here and uh, see how people did. Even um, no one getting 23,000 there. So that goes to show it was a hard round. Yeah, me and uh, and Bag both hedging in Bangkok. Um, really should have gone southern, but you know, it is what it is. And then even um, we had a guess up here from uh, from Piva, so who's one of the best players. And Piva clutched it out. Everyone goes middle at the end here. Piva had to clutch it out to make it in here because like he was also, yeah, just on that threshold uh, kind of as well. Actually, no, he got more points than I did, but you know, uh, yeah. Um, Switzerland was fairly standard. Um, this one, like I guess I had a bit of a bit of a bit of a better vibe than a lot of people who went down here. They were kind of then more under the pump, I feel. Um, but yeah, I okay, that was, that was fine. Um, even got closer than Steak, which is nice. And, uh, yeah, then the Brazil, everyone went more south than me. 
Oh my gosh, I would have been so embarrassed if I went Amapa now. Um, that's so interesting though. Um, I guess it did kind of have a South 5 and actually bag 5k'd that? That's crazy. Okay, let's move on to 21k. Now I get really get the feeling that uh, I should be uh, should be paying more attention. We should be uh, putting maximum amount of effort into these rounds so that I don't get screwed. This is a hard start. Feels like the US somewhere here. Um, yeah, so wooden posts here and everything. Do we have anything on the pole? I think it's US. I don't think it's Canada. Um, which I guess is good, but not really at the same time. Uh, it's like kind of blurry. Interesting. Um, what about these houses here? We got a US flag. That's good. That's good. Um, it is... How warm does this feel? Not too warm to me. I feel like, I feel like Dakotas are, are like a, certainly an option here. It does kind of feel like Canada. So I think I would just go for that, honestly. I think I would just like go middle of South Dakota here or something like that. Maybe towards Iowa. I think that's good. I would say so. I'm a little worried though. Um... And, uh, yeah, we, we do have, like, a, quite a lot of crops. Like, it's, it's definitely cropped pl a cropped place. Um, no corn, though, which would make me feel better for where I am right now. That is, like, wheat, or is it just corn? I'm actually not too sure. Maybe it is just corn, in which case I would feel better. But, um, regardless, I think we go for that. I feel like this is, like, in the right area. So let's see here. It was actually Nebraska there, but 3.8k for 21k goal is okay, I think. I think we should be fine. Okay, next one here, gonna be like near Phnom Penh, I believe. Um, although I might go middle of the country here because I'm kind of bad at Cambodia anyway. Um, and so I'm just trying to think here. Relatively flat, um, relatively dusty. I think I just go slightly north of Phnom Penh here as, as a bit of a hedge here. Let's just go for that. And uh, yeah, what's just south of Phnom Penh there? That's fine, 4.7K is good. So I guess, let's see what we get next here. That's Turkey, that's good I feel. I feel Turkey is good. This feels more Western to me, um, although I may change my mind. Taking a look at architecture here. Architecture is kind of difficult. What about water tanks here? Ooh, it's a double water tank. Mmm, that's interesting. It, it look kind of looks like one of the ones you might see like further south in Turkey, so. Yeah, this this seed looking to shaping shaping up to be relatively difficult, I think. Um, hmm, hmm, like, I don't know. Like, there's not too much info here, I feel. What about, like, any highway marker? That would be, like, absolutely fantastic. Looks like we don't have such a highway marker, but could have been nice. I mean, this town and everything, yeah, it's difficult. It's difficult, guys. Like, a lot of, like, uh, olive trees here, which makes me feel decent about Mediterranean-ish vibe, but same time, like, it could be, like, pretty far inland this way as well. I, I feel like Konya kind of area might be the good hedge here. But, yeah, I mean, same time, guys, like, it's not easy, it's not easy. Yeah, okay, I am looked around a little bit longer, and I don't really get the sense of anything else here. I mean, the soil's really orange, which is slightly concerning to me. I could just hedge here. I feel like that's decent, honestly, but then, like, the, the, um, the olive trees still concern me and make me want to go a bit further west. So, uh, what do we do here? I think, I think I'd just go Ponya area here. I feel like that's kind of better. I'll just try it. And, oh shit, it was Gaziantep. Yeah, but so we only drop a thousand points there, but it, it feels bad. Like, I, I, I did get that vibe, and we did have, like, those kind of water tanks that I think might be more of that kind of area. Anyway, it's okay. Next one here is Uruguay, which is good news. Uh, we can still drop, a f like, a thousand more points, I think, right? So, yeah, that's not too bad. We've got something 48 there. I don't know. This is, uh, this is one where I'd probably consider just clicking middle, I think. Um, obviously we can't afford to drop too many pop points, and on ACW, we probably drop, like, a fair amount here, so, and we could, mm, I, I feel like you do go slightly further north here, and, uh, we could pick at least a road angle that fits here, just in case we, we can, like, pick up some extra points based on that. Um, so how does it go here? The, the road's fairly straight that way, it bends around that way, very 5 able if we had all day to search, but, uh, I don't, so that's, that's fine, that's fine. Um, hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what I actually think of this. Like, I'm sure, like, the rainy coverage is learnable and all that, but... Yeah, I, I feel like I just go here, guys. Honestly, I don't really... I don't really get a strong enough vibe. Like, yeah, maybe... Maybe, like, here would be good to me, I think. And, okay, it was further north... Uh, further south there. We still get a good score, so now we get to see what we need here. We have 2,000 points to spare, and we're in Romania. So I feel like this is pretty fine. Pretty fine, I think. So, yeah, um... Okay, so 
Romania. We should be able to click middle here and get away with it. That's my thinking. We, we can still drop 2000 points, right? If my math's correct. And my math is pretty shoddy. Let's, let's be honest. If you've watched my channel long enough, you've probably figured that out, but I think we good. I think we good here. So we just click middle, right? Um, vibes wise might be a little bit further north to me, but uh, yeah, there's, there's really no point in not clicking middle here, I think, because we, we, we're guaranteed the points. So yeah, yeah, it was a bit further north there and we make it through comfortably. Oh, that was the 21k seed, right? Yeah, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's the 21k seed. Yeah, that is the 21k seed. Great, great, great. I, I just had like a like a sinking feeling that it was 22k for some reason, but that's okay. So let's see. Uh, again, only 23,000 points for the maximum here. That was a, a little bit of, uh, you know, it shows like, you know, best players in the world often getting lower here. Um, but let's see here. Like, obviously, we just kind of scraped in here. Um, and uh, there we are. So I guess like, uh, yeah, still a fair amount of people still scraping through. Len just missing out, actually. Uh, Phineas just making it through here. Same with... Uh, John Kellogg. So, um, interesting here. Let's we'll see. Let's we'll see what happened. Um, John getting the state. Everyone else in the top missing it, apart from Eamon, who actually did just click in Nebraska. Um, but yeah, a lot of people kind of guessing similar area to me. Actually, Phineas going in Sask there. So pretty impressive that he actually managed to bring it back. Um, yeah, this uh, this uh, was pretty standard. This one, wow, Phineas five Ks. That's pretty crazy. I'm I'm pretty surprised, and he's the only one to have done it. So. That's, that must have taken some scanning. How long did it take him? I'm actually kind of curious. Uh, four minutes only, I think. Yeah, four minutes only. That's pretty impressive. But Phineas is good at scanning. Um, and uh, what else do we have here? Yeah, fairly standard Cambodia. Everyone guessing in the right area. Pretty impressive, to be honest. Um, and uh, same with the Uruguay. P people pretty much, everyone going further north than it, than, uh, except for Eamon, but uh, yeah. Okay, so that was 21k. Obviously, Len is out of the competition. To be honest, some of these guys might be out of the competition themselves, given that we don't know what the results of the earlier seeds were. But I think, I think pretty much everyone we, we highlighted here is probably still in it with, with a chance to win. Okay, so let's move on to 22k here. Things are heating up a little bit. We need to play well. Let's see if we can actually manage to do that. And the first one here is Greenland. Not what I wanted to see. I'm not good at Greenland. And we don't have a car that I know here. So, ah, what do we do? This is uh, one of the rare moments when I kind of wish I knew a bit more Greenland than I do. Now I'm trying to think, can I actually think of anything that this would be? Oh my gosh, there are so many towns. Um, I, 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 okay, so where's Nook? Nook's there. I feel like this one, like this one might've started with a Q, but if I look at someone like that, it could be that. I feel like I want to try that, guys. I just, I just like, I don't know. I actually don't know. Let's see. So we have big mountains north there with some kind of a cove. Um, not impossible, but it doesn't really seem like it works, does it? Yeah. Okay. What about south here? We don't really see too much. <laughs> okay. What about it? It's fairly grassy. I will say that about it. And that like makes me want to go a bit further south. Um... I don't know. I don't know. I just don't, I just don't know where this is. So I feel like I just kind of click capital here. And what about this place here? I feel like I've heard of this spot. So I might just go for that. We had big mountains north though. It's, it's like, I don't know. Like it, it's probably findable to be honest. Um, if I wanted to, but, uh, I just, I guess we've got to check this stuff as well. Tasselak. Um, no big mountains north. So that makes me feel good about Tasselak not being it. Um, although it's possible still actually, because, you know, we do, they, they are fairly sizable over here, to be honest. So, yeah, Tesla like is possible. I could hedge like this, but man, when you need 22k, oh my gosh, maybe I do that. Uh, no, I don't want to. I don't want to. I, th I think I go east here. I think I hedge Nook. I'm just going Nook, guys. I don't know where this is. No, <laughs> it was Tesla like. It did make sense. So, we already uh, lost 1.5k. We can only lose another 1.5k. Ay, ay, ay. I don't know, guys. Okay, at least we get Israel here. That's beautiful to see. Beautiful to see. Um, we just have to hope that the rest of them are easy. So, uh, this could actually be south. I don't necessarily want to say it's definitely north, you know? I think we hedge Tel Aviv here. I think we hedge Tel Aviv. I could see this being south. There's a lot of, like, south stuff that's quite flat and very green that, that can bait you. So, I just want to get in here quickly. Um, I could see it being this stuff here. I really could. Um, but, yeah, I mean, obviously this stuff near Nazareth is quite flat as well. So I might just kind of click net Netanya and uh, call it a day here, I think. I mean, it's a real shame that that's blurred. Obviously, we could probably have gotten the round otherwise, but it's classic ACW moment where it's just blurred. So I'll go here. We'll see. And it was, yeah, Tel Aviv area there. So 4.9. That's great. Great bounce back there. Next one's... Okay, this is great. This is, this is Taiwan. So obviously, two rounds, two countries that we definitely wanted to see. And uh, they're back to back here. We've got mountains all sides of us here. So I feel like kind of... 
uh, east coast is kind of more possible here. Might just click there and call it a day, honestly. I think I'm happy with that. Um, 07, so maybe a bit further south here. Yeah. That should that should that should be good like that, yeah. Um, I think so. Yeah, I want to say that's true. So I'm just gonna go for it here. Let's see what it actually is. Okay, that's good. Yeah, four eight four point eight. That's that's great. Okay, next one here. Ooh, a bit of a uh, bit of Russia. Whew. <laughs> that's a bit concerning. Ah, man, I so regret. And we would have been on a great score, by the way, without that Greenland by now, but okay. Okay, a lot of sunflowers, long antenna. Okay, okay. Is it, it kind of felt like Ukraine, first impression. So I am kind of tempted by like Rostov area here. Uh, we've been on a great score. However, obviously anything up to like Samara here is possible. So maybe Saratov is the best hedge, but uh, I don't know if I love that. Okay, what well, landscape wise, it's fairly rolling. Like, um, yeah, I don't know. I feel like that's, you know, that fits well enough, surely. But something about it did give me like a bit of a south impression. So I might like click here, honestly. And we, we, we're not in the, we're not in a place where we need, like, if we click here, we should like encompass everything. And then we have to completely rely on the next round being easy. But as for me, I think I think I do want to go a bit further towards Ukraine here, just just vibes wise. I think so. I think so. I think I click like here. Oh my gosh, guys, this is this is too much stress. This this format is completely stressful. Um, but okay, let's think here. If we click there and it's Samara, we're knocked out. I don't think it's as as hot as north as Samara. It could be like Tula even maybe, but I still think I like this stuff better. So I think I go for it. Oh my gosh, guys. This is too much for my heart. Um, yeah, 1.2k 1 1 in the bank. Let's see here. Okay, was that a bit further north? So 1.2k in the bank, we just spent one. So we have to get a really good guess on round five here. See if we can do that. Ooh, it looks good. Oh, we only have 250 points to spare. Ay ay ay. Okay, so we are in Slovenia actually because of that. That's very good. That's very good. Because uh, Austria has different um, chevrons. I, I get the feeling that this is a bit further west in the country. I, I really do get that feeling. Um, and we don't have too many points to gamble with here. So I think I, I got to commit to the west vibe that I get here. Oh my gosh, guys. Could this, have, could this have gotten closer? I can't believe that Greenland. I should have just clicked in the middle, guys. That's so... Anyway, I, I go here, I think. I think this is like the ideal hedge. Yeah, like that. Because I feel like we don't drop 250 points if it's like all the way to Copa. Um... And it just gives me that vibe, you know? I could even go like here. This this is, this is I think, basically like, we're drawing like a circle like this of what I think it could be. So I'm going, I'm going, screw it. Ooh, your boy knew how to vibe guess the good old Slovenia, one of my favorite countries in the world. And yeah, we, we nailed it. Come on guys, let's go. So there we go, 22,200, a very scary first round. We just clicked Newark, oh my gosh. But we made it, we made it. Okay, so let's see, Steak here with a 24.5, not really a surprise to be honest. That was a, uh, it was actually a relatively easy seed that I made way too difficult for myself. Uh, but let's see here, um, lemon even in the cut there. Very nice, very nice. Uh, so let's see here, I won't actually show everyone here, but let's see uh, how many people actually made it here. So yeah, 22K cut off about here. So 20, 37 people making it only. I actually wanna see just like in general at this point, how many people are still playing here? 66 only, but many of the best players in the world. Uh, and I guess like a lot of people just stopped playing and abided by the rules by this stage. So it should be a relatively select uh, few. Everyone above me getting that right region guess for Russia. I don't really know, like it did kind of look like Ukraine, so I get that, but I kind of thought more Southern. Anyway, uh, I was, of course, closest in Slovenia, we already know. <laughs> uh, then we had, uh, yeah, Israel, we did made a nice guess, so a bunch of people going like kind of on the extremes, but that was because they probably got this correct. Oh my gosh. Is that really that known that everyone got it and I didn't? <laughs> or did anyone come with me? Surely at least one person came with me in Newark. No. Oh my gosh, guys. I mean, obviously it wasn't there, but... <laughs> okay, guys, you know what? I don't even need... I don't even need... I didn't... I didn't need... I didn't need to get it right. Like, also, one of the closest there, so... But guys, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Let's move on to 23k. Put put those demons behind us and uh, take a nice W here. Surely. Surely we can at least win a seed or something. Okay, starting off with uh, Norway here. And Norway is not too bad, uh, but obviously for 23k we need to get close here. This feels like we've got pines, so I like south here. Um, I don't like too far from, like, yeah, I think I just kind of click central south here and call it a day. Like, I don't really get too much of a anything here. It kind of feels more like just like this or something to me, I think. I think that's good. Uh, anything else to say? Yeah, I, I feel like I just felt like that. We'll see. It was a good guess. Very nice guess. 
let's go. Okay, next one here. Russia with Petropavlovsk, surely, with that with that massive mountain there. Um, and, uh, yeah, I don't really know where this is, though. So, obviously, there is still, like, opportunity to drop a few points here. Petropavlovsk, I think we're looking at this, and we're just, like, on an intersection like that, maybe. Let's check the right angle here. It could actually be correct, I guess. Um, it's not, but, you know, that kind of thing. Um... I think I would go there, but yeah, I think we're looking at that. Do we have, do we have like a second peak next to it? Yeah, we do, I think. Yeah. And that one should be the much bigger one. So I think that's good. And, and it feels like the right kind of distance as well. I mean, it's stunning. I would love to go here. And it's crazy that there's this much infrastructure over here. Like it's actually insane. But uh, yeah, I, I, I guess it's also possible that it was these ones, but this feels like, you know what I'm saying? Like there's like quite a lot of like development here. There's quite a few houses. I feel like our South guess is better here. So let's see what this says actually. It would be silly not to read this. Let's see if we can make it out. Okay, so I think I have something here. So on the left-hand side of the screen, we can see Ust and that's this place here. And that's 180 kilometers away. That feels good. And the other places then, Migasovo, Migasovo. I I think it must be this. I think I'm reading it incorrectly. Yeah, yeah, it should be that one. And that one's further away. So yeah, we should just be here. Very nice indeed, 12 kilometers away. Great start to the seed. Let's see if we can continue on. This one is Russia. And, um, and we should be like relatively Southern here. So the question is, what do we do? Um, short antenna. Oh my gosh, guys, this could be anywhere. And obviously we need to get it right. So let's, let's really consider this hard. So, what side's the steering wheel on? Steering wheel is there, is on the left-hand side, which fits for right-hand drive, which is good. So, thinking more of European Russia for that reason. However, got like an interesting, like, a uh, blur there. I'm sure that's, you know, any Russia nerd would know that, but I don't. Ah, I do almost get the feeling that this is more east, honestly. I do get the feeling that this is more east, yes. Um, it's super flat, and it's kind of like just a field. And, like, the trees are very, like, tightly clumped together in a way that kind of reminds me of Siberia more. It's it's risky, you know? I kind of would go, like, somewhere out here, like, past Tumen even, maybe. Uh, so let's see the road angle here could actually give us something, I suppose. It's kind of, like, very steep in a way that I don't really love for a lot of this stuff, of course. Um, the problem is, like, hmm, we have to be confident with our guess here. We have to be confident because... You know, if it is this area, we, we're fine. If it's even out to Novosibirsk, we're in serious trouble. And if it's Krasnoyarsk, we're done. But Krasnoyarsk is hilly, so we should be okay for that. Um, It's not Omsk. It could be like Chelia or something, but uh, maybe I I think I, I think I hedge like here. I think that's okay. Um, The problem is like, as soon as it's Kazan, we're out, right? So. Um, you know, we just have to kind of go off our vibe. This is, this is where I think it is, honestly. I could line it up and everything, but ultimately I'm just going to go for this. And it was. Nice. That's fantastic, guys. This is, this is a hard seed with one Russia. We got the right Oblast even, so that's kind of, that's kind of great. That's kind of great. Okay, we should be, uh, fine now. And Japan is good. Uh, pole tops almost feel like Tokyo, so let's see if we can see any other Tokyo clues here. <clears throat> um, so top of that pole, maybe not. Oh, that looks like, that looks quite Tokyo, but we'll see, I guess. Um, mm. so no pole markings here. This is a little concerning. What does that say? Takeo? Um, mm. okay, what about this? Ooh. Yeah, something city there. Ooh, and it starts with like a T or something. Hmm. Hmm, interesting. Like, oh my. We're, we're definitely getting this. Don't worry. Don't worry. I'm not going to send this incorrectly, but <clears throat> we just have to think here. Can we have like a white plate there? Not helpful at all, unfortunately. A uh, number, not, phone number would be good, but doesn't seem like we have. Okay, 2-3. They seem to be more north, right? I'm pretty sure they start low and end high, as far as I remember at least. Um, but that doesn't really fit for the pole tops here, so I might have to disregard that. That's 0-9 there. Actually, it might be all the way south instead. I really want to see one of these poles, but it seems like we almost have nothing on them. So, uh, yeah. Hmm. Oh, hold up. Let's see these. So I, I'm pretty sure that when you have, like, opposite side... Insula, um, what are, these, what are these called? Transformers like that, that that's more of a, a south thing. Then I could, I could see that working here. Um, let's see if we can actually see anything else to fit that. O, 09 again. So yeah, I think so. I think that's actually a phone code for south. I think so. So then we need like a city starting with T here. Uh, T something city. Tan Takanabe? 
Uh, no, I don't think so. Um, it's not all the way south, I think, because... Um, uh, anything else here? Tamana? Maybe. Maybe, maybe, maybe. I feel like I would probably hedge a bit further north regardless, because we're already on a good score. Um, anything else here? Yeah, I don't know. I feel like I trust the phone codes. I think that the uh, opposite side, in, uh, like, uh, things are up for south as well. And then, um, with that, with that white thing we saw on the pole here, yeah, that can certainly work for south as well. Uh, architecturally, I also don't mind south, actually, yeah, 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 I don't. And landscape-wise, it also fits, and we have these, like, rods on the top of the pole, so... I think I've eventually come to it. I'm glad we didn't send north with that fake phone code, because I'm pretty sure we're good here. So let's go for the guess here, and it was indeed there, and, uh, Takeo City, that makes sense. And uh, it's a good score for us, so we should be good here. 22k, we are well on track for, and especially if this is gonna be Sri Lanka which it appears to be. Yeah, I mean, uh, oh no, it's actually uh, Bangladesh, wow. Okay, so I guess it's like Southern then. Um, but we are on track for a, this is the 23K, was it? Uh, yeah, this is 23K. So we still need to get like uh, within, yeah, we still need to like, I think clicking middle here is safe, but you know, we still need like a decent score here. And so what can we what, what can we glean here? Do we actually have the town name anywhere? Um, I don't know. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Yeah, there's not too much English written in Bangladesh, generally speaking, which is obviously annoying. Um, and yeah, I mean, language-wise, we have to be there, so that's at least something. Um, okay, so I think I might go Dakar here. I think I might go Dakar. So, concern. It could be rung poor, in which case we actually may be eliminated, because I think you can drop up to 900 points up there. Um, but it could be Chittagong, in which case... Yeah, I think we I think we're fine if it's Chittagong. So I think we just kind of click northy northwest Dakar here and call it a day. I think this is good anyway. Like I think it's not going to be too far. And yeah, it was all the way up there, but obviously that's enough points to get the 23k threshold here. Let's see how people did. This was uh, not the hardest seed, but the Russia was the big separator here. So we're actually fifth there, which is which is obviously feeling great. Um, let's see how people did here. So 23k. Ooh, ooh. It is only 15 people who made it there. Um, that's obviously a great result for us here. So a bunch of the best players in the world obviously surpassing the threshold here. Let's see how people did. I mean, the main thing was the Russia. Yeah, a bunch of us guessing in the same place there. To guess the same place as uh, Steak, I'm happy with that, to be honest. And uh, even Blinky making a super nice guess there. Um, and so, um, yeah, yeah, a bunch of people, actually, a lot of people getting closer than me there, which is, I guess, a bit of a skill issue, but, yeah, and a lot of people getting up there. Everyone who could read, uh, Bengali, I assume, uh, but we had a really nice guess on the Norway, which really shored things up for us, and then, obviously, probably everyone 5 k here, or at least getting close. So, that's good. Let's move through to the next one here, which is 24k. So, this is really where the things, oh, this is where the heat's turned up, guys. We cannot make a wrong guess. If we get any Greenland, then, uh, I guess we just, <laughs> we'll lose, but that's okay. First one here. Okay, should be uh, Cambodia. Yeah, I, I assume so. Yeah, this is Cambodia. It is kind of a bit wilder, a bit more forested. It feels north to me, although we have some palms, so that's a bit concerning maybe. Um, or is it? Probably not, actually. I think it's okay. Um, yeah, as, as we've said, Cambodia is not my strong suit. I, I dare say I'm going to make a worse guess than basically everyone here. And Blinky is probably just going to 5k it, so that's unfortunate, but okay. Uh, let's see. Um, so then, we could go up into here, um, and I wanted to just say like this, is my guess, <laughs> but is that a little bit too wuss? This could be maybe a bit too much of a wuss guess, if you know what I'm saying, like, we could probably go for like a more educated one, so let's see if we can think here a bit further. It's very flat. We could place ourselves further that dire direction for that reason. Um, it, it's not cultivated, it's, it's, it, well maybe it, there is like a field here, some kind of a paddock. But most of it's kind of a bit more wild. Oh gosh, guys, don't, I, uh, dude. Oh man, I'm so torn. I'm so torn. The thing is, if I click middle, that's relatively safe. We we drop like 500 points max, and uh, I'm trying to justify this kind of yeah average guess to be honest. Because like, okay, here's the thing. I can see here, and I can also see here. But I feel like I see here more. So I, I feel like I just hedged more towards here. This is a terrible guess inside the lake, but I kind of want to try it. I kind of want to try it. I feel like it's somewhere not too far from there. So I might go like that. I'm trying. I'm trying. Ah, uh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Yeah. That's what I was saying. We dropped basically all the points we can. Yeah. So let's see what we get next. Okay. I guess if we... We're going to try and 5k this. Um, not really my strong suit, obviously, but we'll give it a go. 
Okay, I mean, oh my gosh, guys. I just know Cambodia. I really need to work on it. I really need to work on it. Okay, here we are. Uh, so we've got the number 10 here. Got that motel. Um, I'd love a street name, but obviously we've got to find the number 10 and where it might run through first anyway. So number 10, I'm assuming we're going to be somewhere around here or here. Um, really thought of Utah for some reason. We've got no France though, so I guess, I guess maybe New Mex or something works better here. Um, and so, uh, number 10 here. Okay, there we go. Um, and that does it also stretch here? It does. Okay, so we've got a whole lot of, uh, area to contend with here. We also have like a 10 for the regional road here, so I guess we could scan along and see where a 10 runs through a regional road as well. Um, maybe, maybe that's actually wrong logic, but I just want to see if we can actually make that happen real quick, because obviously that would be a lifesaver, would save me a lot of, like, scanning, potentially in the future. Um, Tucson there, doesn't really feel like a big city like that to me. Um, hmm, didn't see any other number 10 here, Phoenix obviously could be there. Uh, and then it turns into not the number 10 anymore, okay, then it goes out this direction instead. Um, mm -hmm, okay. Uh, nope, nope, no, no, okay, yeah, not coming to me, here it is, and then we shouldn't be in California, so, I cannot make out what that says, that's a real concern, obviously, what about this, Benji's, okay, one way, New Mexico plate there, that could be a New Mex plate too, what about the other stuff here, that's a New Mex plate, okay, so New Mexico is correct here, um, and we have like a bunch of like, we just have to find the town here essentially. So it, it's, it's, it's a fairly big town, um, in terms of like, at least like this, this road has a lot of stuff on it. Oh gosh, guys, I just don't, I just don't know if I back myself to get the rest of this seed though. Uh, okay. So let's see here. So two Phoenix we run through should be in New Max. Okay. So Demning is, Demning is probably not it. It has to be more East West. Okay, so actually, it's actually not that many cities we have to check here, to be honest. With this many New Mex plates. Okay, so let's see here. Um, could it be here? Uh, let's see. So, uh, no. I think I think it bends. I think it bends too much. Unless we were here, but again, hmm. Quality in. We saw Sonics as well. I feel like that's going to be great for 5 King. Denny's we see here. Benny's, yeah. I mean, um, Burger King, Pizza Hut, mm, yeah. Yeah, I mean, there is such thing, there is like a bit, oh, Sonic's, hmm, Sonic Drive-In, that could be it. Do we see a Comfort Inn here as, ooh, ooh, Comfort Inn Suites, mm. and they're both that direction on the south of the road, yeah, we're here, oh my gosh, guys, let's go. Okay, that is obviously good, but we still have a lot of work to do here, uh-oh, it's over, oh, it's not over, <laughs> okay, so, American Samoa, oh, how did I throw on the... Oh my gosh, guys, I just suck at that country so much. I really need to work on it here. So, here we are. I think this is this island. And I think we should really 5k this if we can. And I thought of this stuff up here, maybe. Not so much, I guess. This stuff. Hmm. I'm not sure where it would actually be here, though. It's a bit concerning, maybe. Why do we see water? We don't really see water. We see, we see, we see like, yeah, we see, like, a settlement quite a bit further west here, so... I guess, um, you know, if we were like, hmm, here, but then we, it's, it's like quite a straight, it's quite a straight road there. So I don't know this, sh I guess we're like, but like, yeah, that's too like built up. So actually kind of confused here. Like the, yeah, cause that's kind of Southwest on this kind of heading. So yeah, I mean, yeah, this should be like, it should jump out to me. That's what I'm saying. It should jump out to me at some point here. Um, it could be like this road here. Why not? I'm not really sure how much of these, like how many of them would actually have coverage like that. But I mean, yeah, I mean, could be like here and then it would kind of bend around like that. I mean, it's not possible, but then uh, we have like a driveway coming out like this, but I think the road angle there is wrong, right? Uh, maybe, maybe not. I mean, yeah, it's wrong. <laughs> okay. A bit of wishful thinking here. What about this other island? I, I don't think it's there. Yeah. I think they have a different car there. I think I have a different Google car. So, okay. Hmm. 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 I, do, I don't, I just don't see it. I just don't see it here. It's a little concerning. What about this stuff here? Could be that. Could be that. Don't mind that. Uh, we need this kind of like second little road running off, which I don't see. Um, hmm. 
Okay, well, I think I will just uh, go back to what I had, maybe. Although this end of the island is a bit more wild and a little bit built up, less built up. So I'm, gonna, I'm actually going to go for that instead. Oh my gosh, it was that. Okay. Didn't really, I forgot, I don't even know my Google cars are over here, bro. That's, that's that, obviously. Didn't really find anywhere that fit. Uh, this next Greece, let's see if we can region guess it to see if we actually could have made it here. Um, first impressions is that I probably can't guess close enough here. Um, and I just think like, mm, I think I would go like here maybe. Like in this stuff here maybe it would be a good guess, I think. Athens it was on that island there. Huh. Yeah. Probably would have lost the game there. It was all about the uh, Cambodia, really. And then we would have had a pretty free round here. In fact, a completely free round five. So everyone can five this. Obviously, it's between Newman, which is further over this direction, right? And then um, Port Hedland, which is here. So Newman, oh yeah, that's not that direction. So we're closer to Newman. We should be like... On one, like, what's the next inter intersection here, actually? Um, is it this one? I guess, I guess, uh, I guess not. Like, um, let's see here. Oh yeah, we do have like, uh, soft to the west. Yeah, I mean, it is probably this, right? No. Hmm. So it has to be further down this direction. Hmm. I don't actually see where this is, but obviously it would be fairly, um, we're, no, no, we're not going to hang out. We can just guess, but it was going to be fairly easy to find here. Like you just line up the right angle and everything. So yeah, 23,000, um, man. So. Moral of the story there, well, here's the thing, we get the Samoa, we 5k that, which obviously we could have if I had that knowledge, obviously we couldn't if I didn't have the knowledge, we click middle here, and then we click close to Athens here, we then make it, but um, yeah, not too many people actually scraping in there, like John just missing out, actually tragic there, um, but it was always going to be a hard one to get the requisite score, I can't even see Steak, so Steak must have... Oh no, he did He did get it here. So Blinky, Steak. Uh, apparently Blinky got knocked out on the 21k seed, so yeah, so I heard. But uh, Trabota gets 24,997 there, which is actually crazy. So he actually only misses this one. How did he even get the island? I am actually kind of astonished. But Trabota is legit and one of the best players in the world. But there we go. That was a 24 cable seed. I think I need it like, yeah, I don't know. I think I need to learn... Uh, Cambodia. Obviously, guys, we're going to see who got the 25k on the last one here. We're just going to speed through it, uh, see what kind of seed it was here. This is 5k, able, I guess, but I'm just going to go here. It was a bit in the pump. That makes sense. Next one here. Uh, this is like West Virginia, maybe, or something like that. Um, what do we got? 70 highway here. I, I th I'm pretty sure it's East Coast, not West Coast. It could actually be West Coast as well, I suppose. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to try West Virginia here, see what it actually was here, Let's see what it was, and yeah, it was just over in Ohio, makes sense. With the highway number, that wouldn't be too hard, this is obviously a 25 cable seed as well, um, kind of handpicked to be more 25 cable. Uh, this is probably southern Italy somewhere, not really sure where, it was just like right on the Italy marker here, and uh, yeah, quite gettable that one. I have had rounds in that city before. This one is Montenegro, again, yes, I can see that it's quite 5 cable, and yeah, we're not too far away there. And the last one here is going to be in uh, Kenya. So yeah, very five cable stuff indeed here. Uh, and this one shouldn't be too far from Nairobi, I think. Yeah. Okay, so we actually ended up with the 21,000 there. Obviously, guessing super quickly. Let's see who actually managed it here. Obviously, uh, we didn't quite. And it is only four people out of everyone getting the 25k. I think Trabota is the ultimate winner here. Assuming that he made it through, um, he is the ultimate winner here, which is impressive. And actually, GC giving that a great go to get the 25k. Um, only missed one round there. And uh, yeah, many people are also getting relatively good scores here. But that is it, guys. So thank you very much for watching the video. If you want me to do this next week, I'll be more than happy to. But guys, thank you very much for watching. Congratulations to Drabota, assuming he actually did uh, make it through. A one hour uh, effort there to get the 25k. But you know what? He was only 38 meters away, so it's pretty impressive stuff. And uh, yeah, guys, I'll see you guys in a video very soon. Thank you for watching and peace.